New Year's Eve night. Here's what the GFS thinks. We have a clipper system beginning to move into the upper Midwest. Could this snow be a little bit farther east? down into the states potentially could it be farther south could it be farther north it could be the confidence is pretty high in this cold air out east and warm air out west for new year's eve the models don't quite agree on where the precipitation could be some of these runs put a little bit more precipitation out towards the coast some put a little bit more out towards the upper midwest so let's watch this and see how this develops in a couple days we're gonna have a much better idea of who could potentially see snow falling on new year's eve because i do think someone up there in the north or northeast could have snow falling at midnight on new year's eve then we push past new year's eve that cold air continues to push into the east and this ridge continues to hold for a little bit while longer out west but then eventually you can see getting into january 3rd 4th and 5th we start to get our polar jet at least on the gfs collapsing and i've been talking about this for a while negative pna negative nao and if our arctic oscillation can stay negative this jet could start collapsing pretty far to the south and this is when you get the potential for a snowstorm down here in the south who knows new mexico texas oklahoma arkansas tennessee the carolinas portions of northern mississippi georgia alabama if you do get this jet collapsing very far to the south and you kind of get like a cold zonal flow down here you can get a snowstorm that skirts down the coast here so interesting time frame to watch and you can see i don't really love looking all the way at the end of the gfs run but continuing to see our jet pretty far south so i've been talking about this in my videos end of the first week into the second week maybe even into the third week of january does that polar jet actually as we're seeing on some of these ensembles and the euro weekly does that polar jet actually try to sink to the south and give us an opportunity for some southern snow i think it's possible 